Let's start with the claim that this lockdown was planned more than 10 years ago in the quote Rockefeller document. Now there are a lot of claims in these posts. They say that the Rockefeller document talks about a contagious but low mortality rate virus, that it would have a weaponized version, that the virus would be transported between labs and smuggled out by China, that they'd fund government agencies and give them talking points and scripts, and that governments would coordinate a vaccine development and multiple lockdown phases. Okay, that's a lot. Let's verify. Did this Rockefeller document really predict the COVID pandemic? Our sources, the Johns Hopkins Data Tracker, the CDC, and the Rockefeller Foundation. We found the document these claims mention. It's actually called Scenarios for the Future of Technology and International Development. It was made in 2010 by the Rockefeller Foundation to consider how different technology will affect our world over the next decade. It is 54 pages long with four different scenarios. Only one of them was a pandemic and it's not nearly as similar as these claims suggest. The scenario virus started in 2012, not 2019. It started in geese. It was very fatal, killing more than 8 million people, and many governments put lockdowns and other restrictions in place. And that's the only similarity between COVID and this scenario virus, that many world governments have put in place lockdowns. That's it. This long list of claims doesn't match the document at all and the virus in the scenario has almost no resemblance to COVID-19. So the claims that the Rockefeller document predicted COVID in this pandemic 10 years ago, that's false. You can read the report yourself online. With your Verify, I'm Jason Park.